In this video, we're going to go through installing our public certificate into a Motorola Android device. Uh, I'm going to be using a Motorola ET1 with uh, running Jelly Bean. If you first go and open up your mobility extension document, go to page 35. Uh, in chapter 2, the silent certificate installation, uh, what this is going to go through is uh, we're going to go through the creation of our certificate XML file and it must be named certificate XML file as it is here. Uh, the format of this is a certificate. Uh, inside, inside that you're going to have an install and then the source of where we're going to grab the PEM file from, uh, the alias name that you're going to give it, and what that looks like. Uh, I already have one created. We'll just go ahead and edit it. And the way that looks is this, is it a certificate, uh, install, uh, source, uh, where are we going to install the this, this certificate on the device. Uh, we're going to put mine on the SD card. Uh, I created an MX folder for it. Um, my certificate is called pub.pem. And then I'm just going to say it's a CA cert. Well, we name this, we'll name it to pub cert. So this is all we need uh, within the certificate XML file. Uh, so we'll go ahead and save and close this. Say yes. Uh, then what I'm going to do is I'm going to take that certificate file, go onto my device on the SD card in the MX directory, put the certificate file in there. And then I'm also going to need um, my public certificate. So I'll grab that and put that in the same directory. Now what I need to do is to get this to execute is take and put uh, the certificate XML into <clears throat> this directory, the Enterprise Device Settings MDM Auto Import. As soon as the device sees a certificate.xml file in there, it's going to automatically run that, generate it, and put our certificate in there. So let's go ahead and give that a try. Um, I'll go to my device, open up File Explorer, go into the MEX directory. Uh, we're going to copy the certificate file. And then we're going to go into the Enterprise, Device, Settings, MDM, I'll import. Now, as soon as I paste this in here, it's going to say, you want to paste it? Yep. So now it's a certificate. All I have to do is refresh. If I go out and come back into the auto import, now I'm going to have a results file and my XML file is gone. So now if I go ahead and look and see what happened, it tells me certificate is installed into the key store with alias pub cert certificate is installed into the trusted store with alias. So at this point I do have a certificate installed and um, my device is now ready to use other XML provisioning uh, with signed certificates.